Mary, just looking at these first few games, the two on the road, the trip to the state of Colorado, just what those takeaways were from the University of Colorado and Colorado State to start off. Yeah, I think it was great team bonding for us. Um, even though we only lost uh, Lexi Gruss, we, we brought in a lot of new people and um, we were able to bond a lot more um, as a team. And I think <clears throat> you could you see it on the court, you know, if somebody falls, you know, they're rushing to pick up Toya or they're rushing to pick up Sid. So just some of those little intangible things that we needed to grow as a team, we were able to do um, in Colorado. Offensively and defensively, what positives did you take from those couple games to come into this game at home? Um, offensively, uh, I think we grew because we scored a lot more points this game. Um, defensively, we're still trying to figure it out. Um, you know, just just dealing with the size and the speed and the quickness. So, you know, we have to pick it up in that respect. But I think what I told the team is right now, I put them like a big bucket of water and I put their head in it and it feels like they're drowning. And eventually we're going to come up and we're going to be breathing. You know, it's tough right now, but we got we to gotta fight. We got to fight while we're in that water. You come back home and have this first Division One game on your court despite the loss. Just what it means to start that era and what you can kind of take away from the fact that you get to be in front of your fans, in front of familiar territory before you head on the road again. Yeah, I mean, it's just great to be home. You know, this place is a great place to play. It's very, you know, the crowd is right on top of you. Everybody knows who you are here. Um, so despite the loss, I think it was just great for our fans to see us, you know, and where, what we've been able to do, you know, so far. Next month and a half on the road from November 13th to the 28th of December, just what to do in preparation of knowing that you're going to be all over this country before you come back home at the end of the year. Yeah, I mean, we're just going to be road warriors, you know. So wherever we play, we're going to figure it out. You know, I think I'm a big believer in getting in the gym, you know, day of the game or, or the night before and just kind of getting a feel for it. But, I mean, it's an exciting time. It doesn't matter, you know. The, the hoops are 10 feet wherever we play. So, you know, I just think we just got to keep growing as a team and keep bonding as a team. And what better place to do that than on the road? Lastly, from me, leadership of Latoya Baker coming back onto this team. Had a double-double against Colorado State. Has scored in double figures in all three of your games and has pulled down a bunch of rebounds as well. Just what you could say about what you've seen from her leadership and, and her being here for this, this season. Yeah, I mean, it's a, it's a testament to her work ethic and her growth as a player. You know, as a freshman, you know, I recruited her and then I went to Xavier. But, you know, watching those games her freshman year to where she is now, she's much, much more confident. Um, she's she's playing hard, which she always did, and she's becoming a great leader. You know, there's times in the timeout where I look over and she's leading the timeout. So it's not just her pulling down rebounds and everything like that. It's just she's just become an unbelievable leader, and it's great to see. Yeah, Coach, um, you know, the, the, the first quarter, the first half was really back and forth. Uh, it seemed like your group really came out strong. Um, you know, so what are kind of some of the positive takeaways um, considering your, you know, the quick turnaround for the trip to Colorado? First home game, and it was a really tough point today, but the first half you got shot better. Um, Seemed like you got more points in the paint. So, you know, what were your takeaways from that first half? Yeah, you know, I told the team is it's – Yes, we want to win, and yes, you know, we're facing tough opponents, but we have to show growth in what we're looking to do. You know, we talked about things that we, we do on film, and if we're still making those same mistakes, you know, we're not having any growth. And I think you saw that in the first half, the things we talked about when we watch film, that's why we were able to score. Um, and then we just had like a 10-minute window, the last five minutes and the first uh, five minutes of the second and the third quarter, we kind of just, you know, lost our minds a little bit. But, you know, that's what I want to see from our team is growth and what I'm asking them to do. And so it's a, it's a process. we got to continue to grow. And that's what I talked about with them uh, at the end of the game here. Awesome. Thank you. Thank you.